Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name's Taylor and today I'm going to be doing a week in my life. It's currently Tuesday, January 16th and it is, give me a second, 4.40 p.m. Um, I know it's a little late to be starting a vlog, but I'm getting my wisdom teeth taken out tomorrow. So I thought I'd bring you guys along with me for that. I also just got off work, so that's why I'm well, I didn't just get off work. I got off work like two hours ago, but that's why I'm just now starting this because I was kind of just relaxing a little bit. But I'm waiting for my mom to come home so I can go to the gym. So yeah, I just wanted to start this and I'm going to take you guys along for like how I'm preparing because I've never been under anesthesia before, so I'm kind of nervous. But I thought I'd take you guys along with me to like prepare like what I'm gonna do the night before and everything and then my recovery I know it's not that big of a surgery but to me it is since I've never really like done anything like this I've never had been under anesthesia never had a I mean this isn't like a major surgery but to me it is like I've never had surgery before so yeah I just thought I'd bring you guys along for the experience for me and yeah, so I'll talk to you guys when I'm getting ready to go to the gym. But other than that, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, sorry for the lighting. Um, I'm driving, but I just went to go get myself um, Chick-fil-A. I just got fries and a milkshake because I'm not going to be able to eat that tomorrow. I mean, I can have the milkshake tomorrow, but not the fries. So I wanted to get myself like... A nice, you know, meal. I mean, it's just fries, but still, because I'm not going to be able to eat it tomorrow and I'm going to want it, so I got it for myself. But yeah, so now I'm on my way home. Um, and I'm probably just going to lay down, honestly, and watch a show or a movie or something because my anxiety is really high right now because since I've never been under anesthesia before, it's just like it's getting up there so yeah that's what i'm gonna do but sorry that the the turn signal is so loud but yeah so i'm about to go home and um try and take a shower another shower because i already took one but like i just need one that's like a relaxing shower like nothing too intense just yeah so I'm gonna go do that i'll talk to you guys later good morning guys don't mind my um hair i had to put my hoodie on because i just woke up but um i'm about to get well i'm already dressed to go but i'm about to like make my bed and stuff so i'm uh, it's already comfy for me when i get home so yeah i'm about to do that and i think i might just leave my tv on so i don't have to like worry about it when i get here it's already on what i want it to be on so yeah i'm definitely about to fix my hair though and brush my teeth and i really want some coffee right now but i can't have it and i'm so sad about it because it's um like 7 30 and i'm tired i wanted to sleep in but it's okay so yeah i'm about to go do that and I'll see you guys when I'm on my way. I just got in the bathroom to do my hair. I also made my bed for myself. I'll show you guys. Cause I know like I'm gonna <laughs> I know I'm gonna want it to be like already made and set up for me when I get home. So I'm just trying to sorry. Don't really have a lot of places to set y'all up, but I'm trying to figure out because I don't want my hair to be too difficult because it does get really knotted since it's curly. So I think I'm just gonna do some of this stuff. It's just like leave-in conditioner and then some coconut oil because the coconut oil makes my hair feel really good. Sorry, you guys can't really see me, but okay, so I'm just gonna do that. And yeah, I am wearing the same outfit as yesterday because I didn't really, I only wore this to like chill around the house and I didn't like, I went to Chick-fil-A in it, pretty much it, so. 
yeah i also just got this hoodie yesterday and i was super excited about it because i like broad waves so i was like this is gonna be my surgery hoodie and the hoodie that i'm in pain with so yeah and i don't use a lot of coconut oil either because it will make your hair very oily and gross so i just use a tiny bit and of course i have hair all over my hand but I just really try and drench the bottom because I don't want my roots to be greasy and my ends. Um, well, my hair in general soaks stuff up really quickly because it's curly and naturally dry. So, plus it has bleach in it, so it's even more dry than it was before. But yeah. I don't know if I want to do a ponytail or a bun. I should probably just do a bun because a ponytail is going to get more tangled than... Yeah, and then a button. So I'm just gonna do this. And also, I feel like a messy bun looks better than a messy ponytail when you're like feeling disgusting. Okay. So, and I also am in, like, obviously, you guys know this, I'm new at vlogging, so I don't have a camera, so I have to use my phone. So the quality really sucks, but it's okay. We're getting there. I just don't see the point in buying a camera if I'm just starting right now. Like, because I also need to get a car soon, so I'd rather save my money, get the car, than maybe get, sorry, than maybe get the camera. So, yeah. And now, I don't even know what time it is because my, my clock is on my phone. Oops, I just turned the brightness down on y'all. There we go. Okay, I don't know what time it is, but my grandma's coming to pick me up. So I just have to wait on her to come get me. And we have the flash on right now, but just have to wait on her to come get me. So I'll talk to you guys when I'm on my way there or when I'm there, one of those. So, talk to you guys then. Update guys, I'm home. I just got home from my rest in peace. And yeah, so now I'm just chilling. Doing nothing, but I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, so I just woke up not that long ago. My cheek, it's not really my cheek. My cheek's not numb anymore. It's just right here is numb. So the numbing's wearing off and <clears throat> yeah, my mouth does hurt. Like obviously right now it's not going to hurt that much. I also just took pain medicine. So yeah, but here's the Luna. She's keeping me company. <laughs> but yeah, so I've just been relaxing. Um, I can't really like smile, but I had a smoothie. I don't know if you can see the cup right there, but had a smoothie, took my medicine. So now I'm just kind of chilling. And honestly, I feel way better than I thought that I would. I'm just annoyed because I want actual food. Like, when I woke up from my nap, the first thing that I wanted was, like, pizza. <laughs> but I can't eat that, so I had to have a smoothie. And, yeah. And then I was gonna door dash myself Panera, but it's freaking $20 just for a soup. Like, a small soup. Not even a big soup. A small soup and, like, a frozen coffee thing. Because I haven't had coffee today, and I want coffee. So, I didn't get that. So, I kind of figured out, so... I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, so it's the day after I got my wisdom tea taken out. I don't know if you can tell, but um, this side of my face is really swollen. Um, Yesterday when I got home, I was, I mean, you guys saw, like, I was really drowsy for from, like, I think I got home at, like, maybe 10 or 11, but I was, I went to sleep from around then until two but yeah so i 
Then after I woke up, I felt perfectly fine. Like I had no pain in my mouth whatsoever. Maybe like a little bit, but not like a lot. But today, let me tell you, when they say that today is the worst day, today is the worst day. I've been down like this, like it feels like all of the pressure goes straight to those teeth. So try not to bend down, but I'm about to make a smoothie so I can take my medicine and my pain medicine. So I have an antibiotic so I don't get an infection and then I have pain pills. So I'm about to make a smoothie so I can take that because I can't take them on an empty stomach or else I'll throw up. So take you guys with me to do that. So first I just grabbed, sorry you can't see me. I had to put you in the paper towel holder so it wouldn't fall but just grab this then obviously we need this and there's a coffee thing right there um, i do yogurt berries bananas a whole banana so just break it up though And then, like, I feel some bleeding. Not feel it, taste it, but I guess I'll figure that out because I need to eat something. So, once I do that, just grab a knife to cut the strawberries with yogurt. It's really good. And I do, like this big of a spoonful because I just like the way that the yogurt tastes so set that in the sink. Try not to get strawberries on my hoodie. Okay. Yeah, like I do like that much. Cause I get scared it's gonna make my stomach hurt if I do too much, so I just don't do a lot. And then I'll do then I'll do some ice. Again, I don't do a lot of ice. But I'll do some ice. And I like to try and push it down because it makes it look like there's not a lot of room and what there really is. And then after that, I've been putting sugars in the sh sugars sugar in my smoothies since I got my wisdom teeth taken out. Normally I don't, but like I I want to enjoy the smoothie a little bit more, and sometimes it just isn't sweet enough. So I've been putting a lot of sugar in here, which is what I'm doing right now. And then. I'll put like a little bit of honey because I don't really like the taste of honey that much. And then I have to get the blender out. I use the magic bullet. I'm, I don't even know if they still have these if I'm being completely honest. I really don't know. We got this a, like a long, long time ago. So I don't know if they have this anymore, but it worked good. So whatever. Then I just pop the lid on here. And I always get nervous that it's gonna like fall out. So make sure I twist it. And then I like to shake it up. I think I didn't twist it tight enough. I like to shake it up. So just like everything gets shaken together before it gets blended and then blend it. <laughs> Out, so yeah and then got my smoothie yeah my face is really swollen on that side I should probably put ice or something on it because you can like just right here looks really swollen but yeah so oh my god from this angle it really looks swollen I don't like it, but it doesn't feel swollen. Like, that's the thing. Like, it feels normal. Just, like, in pain. So, I'm about to go lay that back down. Da, 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 da. I'm about to go lay back down. 
I'm gonna take my pain medicine with me. But I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. And I probably won't be doing anything. So talk to you guys in a little bit. Hey y'all, so I'm just kind of laying in my bed right now. I just got back from the grocery store my grandparents took me because obviously I can't drive because one, I don't have a car and two, um, shouldn't be driving when I'm on like pain meds. So they took me to the store because I needed to get like the little mac and cheese like bowl things and I got some ice cream and yogurt, but I'm icing my face right now because it's very swollen and it hurts but the ice is helping so I've just been kind of chilling all day like I'm just really like drowsy and like tired but my little Luz has been laying with me all day like she knows something's wrong she normally she'll go in the living room and like look out the window all day she hasn't wanted to do that because if she did she'd be jumping off my bed right now to go do that she's just been laying with me all day so yeah I was told that today was like the hardest day but it kind of feels like the same as yesterday just like when I was eating my mac and cheese like I couldn't open my mouth as wide as I could yesterday so that's like really the only difference and then like when I was bending down to look for like my sock or whatever like the pressure just went to my tooth but other than that it kind of just feels the same as yesterday and there was like a little tiny bit of bleeding today but I just put like one gauze pad in and then it was fine. So yeah, I honestly don't think it's that bad, but like, obviously I only got one side done. So if I would have got both done, yeah, it would have been horrible. I probably would have wanted to die, but I honestly feel okay. It's just like my cheek is so swollen and yeah, I don't know. I'm just like tired, but I'm bored. Like, yesterday, when I woke up from my nap, I was like, I feel like I could go run a marathon right now. Like, I felt great. I felt like I could go to the gym, but I'm not going to go to the gym, but I felt like I could because, like, I'm bored. Like, I want to go do something, but, like, even just driving in the car made me nauseous. So, not the smartest idea, but yeah so i'll talk to you guys later i know like this is kind of boring because it's just like me laying in bed all day but hopefully by tomorrow i'll be able to at least like go walk luna we'll see i guess but yeah so i'm about to just take a nap probably chill and then i'll catch up with you guys later hey guys so i just woke up and as you can see my cheek is still swollen and <clears throat> my mouth kind of feels worse than it did yesterday. I don't know if that's, like, a good or a bad thing, but it definitely feels worse. I don't know if it looks worse, but, like, it's pretty swollen. Like, it hurts to, like, like, it doesn't even, like, my smile on this side is fine. This side, not so good. Like, I don't know, but it really hurts, so... I know this vlog is boring because I've just been like laying in bed for the past three days and I was hoping like today I would be better and wanting to like get up and do stuff but no nope not even there yet and my nose is peeling <laughs> and I brushed my teeth yesterday obviously I didn't go past my canine tooth on the side like try and feel better because it hurts so bad and I feel so gross not brushing my teeth every morning, but, like, it hurts in the morning. Like, at night, it doesn't hurt as bad, but in the morning, it hurts so bad. So, I'm just gonna sit here and do nothing all day again and watch The Flash. But if anything changes, I'll definitely let you guys know. So, talk to you guys later. Hey guys, so it's Sunday, the... a couple of days after I got my wisdom teeth out. And if you can't tell, I'm feeling a lot better. I just got home from work, but I was just drinking a frappe from McDonald's. I can't drink it out of a straw still, so I was just sipping it. But I'm pretty sure one of my stitches just came out, like, in a good way. Like, fell out because they're dissolvable or whatever. So, but 
Yesterday, I didn't really vlog because I was just like, I don't know. I just didn't feel good, but I've been eating like real food finally and I feel I'm so happy about it. Like, I just had McDonald's. <laughs> I've just been wanting real food for so long and I kind of have it. Like, I feel like I've been doing like a water diet. Because I've been eating, like, literally just soft foods and barely even that. Like, I've normally just been drinking water. So, yeah. But I just got home from work, so I'm just chilling. And I don't know if I showed you guys, but I got my nails done. Really like this color. But, yeah, I'm just kind of chilling. Just got home not that long ago, actually. I got home, like, an hour ago. So, just hanging out on the couch. Probably going to take a nap. I was going to go to the gym today, but then I started getting really nauseous at work. So I was like, mm, maybe I should wait until tomorrow or Wednesday to go. Because I don't want to risk, one, passing out at the gym, and two, throwing up. I really don't want to do either of those. So I was like, I'm just going to wait and go when I feel better because I'm still taking, like, antibiotics. I took myself off of the pain meds that they gave me, and I've just been taking Advil because I just feel like it's so much better. And my cheek is still swollen, but, like, not as much. Ow, like, right there, it's a little sore, but, like, it's not as swollen as it was. I know you guys saw, like, how it got real. It was really, really swollen. It was bad, but yeah so i don't know what i'm gonna do for the rest of the day i was thinking about maybe going to target later because i haven't been able to uh, use the gift card i got from christmas because every time that i go they never have anything so i end up leaving like with no spend um my gift card on something that i'm not gonna use so i might go do that later but i don't know so yeah yesterday was really good though like i know i didn't vlog that much because like i did honestly i did more than i've done any other day like i've been in the house i think thursday i went to go get groceries with my grandparents but we just did like the car side pickup at Publix, and then i came back home and i was in the house all the way until yesterday so yesterday was like my first time being outside since I got my wisdom teeth out, like, actually going and doing something. So, me and my family went to breakfast, and then I went and got my nails done. Came home, and that was pretty much it, because I just, like, can't do a lot of stuff, because I'll get really nauseous. Like, work, my job is closed on Sundays, but we still have, like, dogs boarding. I work at, like, a dog daycare, but we still have, like, dogs boarding and stuff, so... There wasn't that many dogs boarding because it's not like a holiday or anything. So it was really easy just to be at work with little dogs, like not that many dogs because I was getting really nauseous and they let me leave a little early just because I was getting really nauseous. So yeah, but hopefully to, be to better, hopefully tomorrow I feel better because <laughs> I really can't be leaving work early because I didn't work four days last week. So my paycheck this coming week is going to be horrible. Absolutely horrible. I'm not excited for it. Yeah, but I'll keep you guys updated. If I go to Target, I'll vlog. But yeah, I think I'm about to just take a nap. Probably take a shower and then take a nap. We'll see. So I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, so I'm on my way to Target right now. I'm just gonna go look around because, like I said before, every time that I go, there's, like, nothing there to get. But, yeah, so I'm just going to look around because I'm bored. And I took a nap already and a shower. If you can't tell my hair is wet, I mean, you probably can't because it's up. But, yeah, so I'm about to go do that and maybe get Starbucks while in there just because I'm bored. But yeah so i'll take you guys with me once i get there i'm on my way now hey guys so i just got out of target and i forgot to vlog i'm so horrible at this but i'm new so giving myself a break but i did find some stuff i spent 85 dollars, but i had 50 in a gift card so technically i only spent like 35 dollars. so yeah but i'll give you guys a haul i already opened one of them because so i don't really 
I just turned on the back window wiper. I don't really get that much makeup, so I got myself lip oils. And I don't even know if these are good or not because I really do not do my makeup. Like, what I have on right now, which is my eyebrows done and mascara, that's, like, all I do. I rarely do my makeup. So, I said screw it and got myself makeup. So, I only got this. I got two lip oils. So, this one's, like, tinted. And it's in the color Skinny Dip. And it's by Lux. I've never heard of that brand, but we're trying it. So, let me do the haul, and then I'll try it for you guys. So, then I got just, like, a normal lip oil with no color in it. This one has color. That's why I want to try it, because I'm, like, I'm really funny about colors on me. But, yeah, so I got another lip oil. Then I got this. Oh, I guess these are by ColourPop yeah so then i got myself this it's like a highlighter stick so i got this then i got some tanning stuff so i don't like using like the mitt or anything so i just got like lotion that's like tinted and then i got the face stuff and this is by jerrigan's it's the natural glow daily moisturizer and then i got the one for my um face and then, um, so I have, like, no clothes, so I got myself these biker shorts, really cute, really cute. I also have no shorts, all I wear is sweatpants and jeans and long sleeve shirts because I have no clothes. Then I got myself this, like, black tank top. Yeah, this was only $5. I don't know how all of this stuff was like 80 something dollars. Oh, I forgot that I got this. And I got myself this hat. It just says Apri Ski. It's really cute. Like the color, like the color. So, yeah, that's all I got myself. I really don't spend that much money on myself. Like, the most I'll spend on myself is to go get my nails done. That's literally it. So, I said, screw it. If I spend some saving money, I spend some saving money. I don't care. Okay, now let's try the lip oil. This car doesn't have any lights in it. There's a dude right next to me. So, that was creepy, but... There's a child, there's children in the car getting out. What is happening? Oh, there's a person in the car. Okay, so here's what it looks like. Looks cool, looks cool. I'm gonna wait for these people to leave because I don't like when people look at me while I put things on, so. I'm not gonna put that much because I'm about to eat, but. I still can't close my lips all the way because of my wisdom teeth, but I'm trying, I'm trying. I don't know if that looks good or not. It just looks like normal lip oil, but I like it. Like, I like the glossiness of lip oil and how it makes your lips feel moisturized, so that's why I got it, but yeah, I like it. It looks good, and I just, I don't know, like... I just, I, I just like how it looks. Like, it makes your lips look more voluptuous, I guess. I don't know. So, yeah. I'm about to go home, though. I don't know what I'm having for dinner. My mom actually just texted me, so. I should probably look and see. Oh, it does look good. But I should probably look and see what she said because she doesn't want to cook. So, we have to get something to eat. And I'm limited on things that I can eat. Why do people keep freaking looking at me? But <laughs> I'm limited on things that I can eat. So I'll get back to you once we figure that out. Update. I'm running back in Target because my mom needed something and I forgot it. So going to grab that. It's so fun. But she sent me a picture of it and what aisle it's on. So not that bad. completely forgot. I can't believe I forgot that. Actually, I can because I forget things very easily. We have so much Valentine's Day stuff. 
Guys. I was gonna get this jacket. It's forty dollars. I'm not paying forty dollars for that. Are you kidding me? Well. I'll talk to you guys once I am out of here because there's people staring at me and I don't like it. Bag secured. <laughs> Bag secured. There's a stuff. But yeah, I'm waiting on my mom to text me back because I don't know what I want. And my cheek, I don't know if it's still swollen or if I'm just like talking like that because my face hurts. Because like, like it's hard for me to rub my lips together but i don't know what we're getting to eat because i want chick-fil-a but it's sunday and chick fil A's closed so i don't know i don't want mcdonald's i can't really eat pizza right now i want pizza but it's too crunchy i want wings but i feel like wings are too crunchy or like maybe just too hard for me to eat and like if i'm getting wings i want to enjoy the wings like i don't know i don't know what we're getting but and it's sunday so it's like we have to hurry up and decide because things are going to start closing but i don't know what i want so really our choices are mcdonald's wendy's sounds disgusting um burger king also disgusting canes but i don't really like their chicken dairy queen but like i don't know if i want that either um yeah that's really it honestly i don't know what i want i'm indecisive like i want olive garden but that's expensive. Honestly, now that I think about it, since prices are, like, since everything's so expensive, like, going to Olive Garden is basically just, like, going through a drive through Like, if I'm being completely honest with you. I don't know what I want. I'm just hungry, but I don't know what I want. I already had McDonald's today and yesterday, but I don't know what I want. I kind of want wings, but... If I'm gonna get wings, I wanna be able to like, like actually bite into it and not have to pick it off. Like I hate doing that. I don't know. I guess I'll let you guys know what I get for dinner. Guys, we're at Wawa. That's the only thing I could think of. And I just rewatched the video that I took. My cheek is definitely still swollen. Like just the way I'm talking, like only this side is moving. That's how it looks like to me, I don't know. But yeah, so I'm about to go in Wawa. Have to go to the bathroom first. So I'm gonna do that, then I'm gonna order. So, don't know what I'm going to get yet, but we're at Wawa, so I'll show you guys what I get. Got back in the car, and I know I showed you guys me getting um, a quesadilla, but it was steak. It wasn't like ground beef, and I'm very specific about how I like my food. I'm picky, so... I just got chicken and fries, and I got, oops, wrong drink, and I got a blueberry pomegranate lemonade. Let's try it, because I haven't had this before. Good. It's good. That's good. I already know I like their chicken. I haven't had their fries though. Their fries are new. They used to never have fries. So let's try for fries. Let me put you up there. There we go. Okay. Let's try a fry. Oh, they look good. They're good, like. I like them, they're good. They kinda remind me of, they remind me of Arby's fries. But they're good. They are good, I'm not gonna lie. 
<gasps> Look at that little wawa bag. Like, things. <laughs> Don't hate on Wawa, but I do have to say, I was living up north for college, didn't stay for too long, but they had this one place up there, it's like Wawa, called Sheets, way better than Wawa. They need it down here, they need it in Florida. Get rid of the Wawa, replace it with Sheets. Like, it was just so much better than Wawa, I don't know what it was but it was so much better they had like these peanut butter milkshakes <sighs> that was my weakness the peanut butter milkshakes that was my weakness 100 percent 100 percent and i'm about to find a website where you can like tell florida what they need to put here and i'm gonna say you guys need sheets in largo florida that's what y'all need because sheets was so good. Their fries, bomb. Subs, oh my God. I don't know if they had chicken nuggets. I think that they did. I didn't really like their nuggets. Like they need to keep the Wawa tenders, but everything else that they had, great, amazing. <sighs> so good. This is so good too kind of just tastes like they bought it from Wendy's because Wendy's has this. Tastes the exact same as Wendy's, just like watered down. So, But it's still good. I'm not complaining. So I'm going to go home now and enjoy my Wawa that I could have literally gotten chicken from anywhere else, but I decided Wawa. So yeah, but about to do I already put my seatbelt on about to do that so let's go now I see how people keep their phones up here but I feel like it's not gonna stay up there for very long my phone decided it wanted to play Rod Wave instead of um recording me so it turned off but that's okay we love Rod Wave Rod Wave is amazing so I'll talk to you guys when I get home see you guys later Okay guys, I'm home. That's the end of my vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.